I'm going to show you the best places to find the right music for your type of indie game. We're talking copyright free, commercial use, and royalty free music. As you may know, not having the proper music and the legal ducks in a row can result in anything from having your game removed from the platform that it's on to legal implications and potentially having to pay royalties. But what you may not know is that even if your game is free to use, you still need non-copyrighted music or you can run the same risks. But fear not, I have a list of recommendations that will cover a lot of different game genres depending on what you're going for. There is truly something for everyone in this list and they will all keep you and your indie game safe. So let's get into it. My first recommendation is Zatsplat. Zatsplat quite literally has thousands of different types of sounds, and they have sounds specifically for games. Zatsplat has music for games, sound effects, and they even have an entire category just for UI sound. You can do an incredible amount for free, they just have a time limit, you can only download a certain number of sounds or songs within a certain time frame. However, it's not very restrictive and you can definitely pace yourself as you're going through these. Sounds. The thing I really love about Zatsplat is that it's one attribution in one place. You don't have to keep a list of all the songs and the sounds and the corresponding artist. You just have to give credit to Zatsplat. Simple and easy. It's hard to go wrong and it makes you feel really, really safe as a creator. My second recommendation is freestockmusic.com. While they don't have the library that Zapspy would have, they still have a really robust library of sounds, specifically music. If you are creating a 3D explorative or adventure type game, this is the site that you want to go to for sure. If you really like environmental music, especially themed environmental music, think Fallout 4, think Breath of the Wild, think Assassin's Creed Odyssey, anything where you're spending lots of time adventuring or exploring your surroundings, these guys are gonna have it. Freestockmusic.com is free to use with attribution and they make attribution really easy, it's awesome. However, if you don't wanna worry about the attribution, the licenses are really, really affordable. We're talking in the range of about $8 for a royalty-free commercial use sound. On a side note, I really hope that you're getting value out of this type of content and if you are, please be sure to like and subscribe. The next one on this list is freesound.org. Uh, this one I find particularly helpful if you're looking for retro sound effects or chiptune style music. I used this when I was making my first game, which was a recreation of the game Brick Breaker, and I found a lot of really great retro sounds on this. Unlike some of the other sites, this one, individual artists can actually upload their own music and sounds to the site and set their own copyright rules. So each sound is a little bit different depending on what artist is uploading it. However, it's very clearly listed um, what exactly the music is rated for, if it's rated for commercial, if it's rated for non-commercial, how you can distribute it, and so on and so forth. They also have a really wide variety of sounds, music, and sound effects. However, you might have to do just a little bit of digging to find the right sound for your game. The next one up is Free PD. Let's talk about Free PD. Free PD is an absolute gold mine. It is so underrated. I have never seen this site listed anywhere. I was actually introduced to it by ChatGPT, which is a little creepy, but okay. FreePD actually allows you to search for the certain type of mood that you're going for, and while they don't have a crazy selection, the selection that they do have is really top tier, so you don't have to do a lot of digging to find a really great sound. Especially in making mobile games, it's really hard to find that type of music that's casual and relaxing, but that's not too overly in your face. These sounds are super high quality, and not only that, they are royalty free, they are commercial free, and you don't even have to give attribution. So definitely check them out, it's a great site. Next one on the list is Ben Sound. Um, with Ben Sound, you can also filter by genre and mood. Now I've seen Ben Sound used in other lists before, mostly pertaining to creators. While a lot of the sounds might work better in the background of a YouTube video, if you're looking specifically for real instrumental music for your game, think the first tree, think narrative stories, think uplifting and inspiring games, this is a really great place to start for that type of music. 
Now, if you've made it this far, you're gonna get a bonus one because you're the real MVP here, okay? This one's a bonus because you really gotta dig. Copyright's kinda all over the place, but there are some absolutely amazing sounds on this site, and that site is opengameart.org. This site is known primarily for its pixel art. However, they have a really, really great list of sounds made by individual artists who are also game developers. Oftentimes, these creators just want to have their music or assets used in a game. But I promise, once you dig a little bit, you're going to find some really amazing music for your game. If you like this video, I think you'll really like this one, and I will see you in the next video.